all we have to type two text words and one button here text box 1 text box 2 and we have to take here one button now we have to take few labels here we are giving enter name here we are giving we are going to set here insert so now we have to create one database so for database we have to add new item and select here SQL database now add first time it takes such time to load so please wait here you have to press next now press finish now server explorer we are getting this database now in this database we have to create one table we are going to take two field one is name and one is city and now i save this table right now in this table there is no record we check it we can see here there is no record available here so now we have to do database connectivity so in insert We have to type database connection screen. Right click on database. In properties, select this data source, copy and paste here. Now we have to do here database connectivity code. here we have to write open execute non query now we have to write here insert query first single code you can see here this is the single code this is double quotes again double quotes again single quotes you have to make this type of pattern inside this you have to pass plus plus sign and here you have to pass text box name here not zero but round bracket now here i am going to pass message box
after this message we have to clear our text box now we are going to run this application here insert we are getting this message box now we are going to check in our table press exclamation sign now you can see here we are getting one recording our table now we are going to perform delete operation So delete operation again copy and paste code and here we have to write delete query We are delete upon name. Now again, we are going to run this. Now we have one recording table with name Amit. So I am going to write Amit and press here delete button. Now we are going to check in our table. We have to refresh our table, and we can see here there is no record available in. our table now we are going to take one another button update for update again we have to copy and paste this code here we have to write update query we are going to update name we are going to pass the old name in text box 1 and new name in text box 2 so for old name we have to pass the year and here we have to pass new name value which we write in text box 2 now again we are going to execute our application now right now we have no record so first of all we have to add one record name amit city rajkot record inserted successfully now we want to update this record you can see here for new value we are passing text box 2 so here i am going to pass noble and here we are going to pass amit when i press this update button now in table it replaces noble to amit now we can see here there is one entry with noble rajkot now we are going to display our record to display we have required one data read view here we have to pass select query
now again we are going to run this application you can see here now I can display record in the read view now I am going to insert new record insert you can see here I can display record again so this way you can insert update delete and display operation in csap.net thank you